We're going to take a quick run through to the press preview of Carol Walker, my compliment, my enemy, my oppressor, my love. We'll have remarks by the uh, curator in a few moments in the gallery uh, to the It really does, I think you'll agree, uh, reveal the full complexity of the stunning accomplishment of our work. I'd also like to welcome back Philippe Graham. It's very nice to be back uh, under this roof and between these walls. The feeling I got uh, with the Whitney and Kara's show, uh, two, for the, two for the price of one. Uh, and uh, and it's, been, I mean, it's been a real privilege and pleasure to, uh, to be able, after having the exhibition at the Walker, having the exhibition on the road to, uh, to Paris, to be able to have, uh, to have the exhibition. Uh, in uh, in Caras town in um, in New York City, as you all know, uh, Cara is best known for exploring the raw intersection of race, gender, sexuality, and exploitation, and unleashing the memory we wish we could escape and the desires we fear as much as we invite. She liberates on the wall of this gallery the traditional proper Victorian medium of the silhouette creating a theater space in which her unruly cut paper character fornicates, yes, fornicate, and inflict violence and pleasure on one another. Kara uses, uses the silhouette to critically engage the representation of the black body in Euro-American history and to insert herself in a history that might have excluded her. She appropriates and twist the code of the constructed national memory. She produces what has been identified as a form of visual terrorism. And I say, uh, in her case, I mentioned terrorism as a compliment. Uh, she uses, or should I say abuses, existing narrative, historical and fictional, in order to provide an, an underlayer for her own tales and fantasies, which assert the absurdity the incongruity of this historical depiction are they are admitted and digested through popular culture, be it literature or Hollywood film. She, in a way, provides us with what Kevin Young has identified in the catalogue of the exhibition as an history of fantasy in which Cara frontally opens herself to her gaze. The exhibition that uh, you are discovering cover about 14 years, 14 years, Cara, yeah, 14 years, 18 maybe, this year, 14 years uh, of work, and it's extreme elegance, as the extreme elegance of the work will lure you in a visual journey between Freud, Matisse, Dick Gregory, between Griffith, Marquis de Sade, and Uncle Tom, a visual journey that only stands as a long history of misunderstanding, and eventually of broken social contract. An history with no truth, never, but too often a theater of individual cruelty and power that we struggle with in the present tense, at every pages of our newspaper, at every corner of a culture of civilized barbarity in which racism and abuses are rampant evil, as if the past was simply refusing to pass. Thank you very much for coming.
the creation of Ameri African America, a moving picture by Carol Walker. only, but if you aren't, just act like it. Black on black crime, first to first. Manio, manio, the spectacle of a black girl cat fight. Finger point matron. There have been very few raids, rapes or killings by black women upon their assailants. This is to prove how endlessly forgiving and just many black women can be. Here we have an entire circular gallery with a floor to ceiling mural, and I'll give you the abbreviated title, which is Slavery, Slavery, presenting a grand and lifelike panoramic journey into the picturesque Southern slavery. The actual title goes on for about another paragraph. This is from the Norton Collection. These are some wonderful collages. Well, these pieces are untitled colored pencil on paper. This video installation is titled Calling to Me from the Angry Surface of Some Gray and Threatening Sea. I was transported. It's a five part video installation. And it is interesting that even with her video works, with the shadow puppets, it's still all about the light and the dark black and the white. I tried to get Kara to do an interview, but uh, she's a little bashful and declined. This is James Com coming to you from the Kara Walker opening at the Whitney Museum. Thanks, Kate.